Some time ago, someone left a comment on one of my videos claiming that evolution is inconsistent with what we know about genetics. It said, Darwinism would predict that the closer the evolutionary branch is between two organisms, the more of their genome they would share. But research shows the opposite. Unless you want to try to make the case that humans are as closely related to fruit flies as they are to chickens. They added a link to a web forum post saying that the fruit fly shares about 60% of its DNA with humans, and about 60% of chicken genes correspond to a similar human gene. The the mistake being made here is that those percentages don't actually correspond to a specific number of genes. Fruit flies do not share the same number of genes with humans that chickens share with humans. The reason the percentage of similarity is the same for a fruit fly as for a chicken is that a fruit fly has a much smaller genome. Assuming these percentages are correct, 60% is the percentage of genes in a fruit fly that can also be found in a human. Given that the fruit fly genome contains 14,000 protein encoding genes according to the journal Nature, that would mean that 8,400 of those genes are also in humans. If evolution is correct, the total number of genes shared with chickens should be higher. Given that chickens have about 20,000 to 23,000 protein encoding genes, and 60% of those genes are shared by humans, that works out to be 12,000 to 13,800 genes. So chickens do share more genes with humans than fruit flies do, just as the model of common descent based on the fossil record would predict.